Yo, what's good? Today we're gonna be reacting to, I'm so excited, Jungkook standing next to you. Literally just came out. My reaction to seven unfortunately got taken down from YouTube. So if you wanna check that out, be sure to head over to my Patreon, link to that down in the description. Over there I have tons of reactions, you know, the videos that get taken down, album reactions, and Technique, singing technique, don't you forget, that's what this channel's about. Singing technique videos is over there as well. But let's just see what's going on because his last two songs, pretty good. Breaking my expectations, I'll say that. And I had pretty high expectations for him. What's going on today? Huh? Okay. Hey, that's what I'm talking about. Oh, okay. Woo. There could not have been a more fun intro. <laughs> that was so insanely, incredibly well produced. Hitting us with the falsetto. Mm. You know, he's getting some of that. BTS dipped its toes into some of the style, right? With like, I believe songs like Butter. And I think I even maybe said it back then. Hey, I'm liking this style. I'm liking where they're going. I just don't feel like it's fully fleshed out so far. This kind of feels like butter or that type of a sound way more fully flushed out. That's just my opinion. I'm sorry if that makes people mad. How we love to ride is something we mm. control. Oh, you know why it works so well? I'm so sorry for pausing this. This is kind of like this 80s sound, right? Jungkook kind of has a weekendish sort of tone and we're kind of getting a little bit of that, a little bit of Justin Timberlake as well. But it's so, it's really fresh, to be honest with you. I'm comparing it to other artists, but. <laughs> what note even is that? This album has to be good. Every single song that he's put out has been incredible. Ooh, oh, oh. It's cool how he like jumps into that like, ah, that O type of a belted sound, which by the way, that gets pretty high up there and it's pretty difficult to, to get that, the body that he gets with it. And in general, I think we've been hearing Jungkook singing way higher, way more often in a lot of these songs. It's almost not noticeable. Like, I don't even know that I brought it up because he's just getting them out so easily in ways that I didn't hear in his voice before. And I think this coincides very well with a lot of the technical changes that he's been making to his vocal style. He's kind of moving away from kind of this like almost Justin Bieber-like vocal tone and into more of this Justin Timberlake, The Weeknd kind of a thing where things kind of lighten up in a sense. And he's just able to ascend to the gods. Oh, and then right, oh my lord. He jumps from the very light falsetto into the ow, oh, which is kind of light and bright, and now into these thick, these mid-range, upper mid-range belts that are just, hey, kind of shouty, right? Hey! Right? And the one thing to also keep note of is he's singing at many different volumes here. A lot of singers at home don't recognize this. The reason why it sounds so even is because the production is so tight and so well done that it doesn't really sound like he's doing all these crazy shifts in his voice. In real life, he actually is. Let's, let's finish it up. Oh! All right. This is giving me old BTS vibes, and I don't even like, there's, oh, just the energy of this track is incredible. A saxophone? Leave your body go and let the sun in the moon. 
so good, dude. Listen for it. And then into some falsetto, yeah? I love it. I think this is, to me, one of the more vocally demanding tracks that he has ever done. Would be so excited to hear him do this like uh, live in some sort of an acoustic situation where he doesn't need to dance. You know, that aside one of the more vocally demanding songs that I've heard from him and also one of the most creative and interesting ones that I have heard so far. And all of his songs, like I said, have been really good. But to me, this one is just on a uh, just on another level. <laughs> Let's hear what this goes. <laughs> Almost Michael Jackson moves there, yeah? Dude, he's such a good dancer. It's crazy. So many layers. Like, that is a such... I'm so sorry for pausing it, but that was such a musically complex bridge. The drums doing something crazy. You got the saxophone riffing and running all over the place. You got his vocal lines weaving in and out. So cool. And then back into this very simplistic sounding... Funk, right? That is very Michael Jackson. Very in incredibly Michael Jackson. Like, you know, The Weeknd, Michael Jack, the same general sort of vocal style, right? Although Michael Jackson does sing even lighter than Jungkook, you know, he had a different thing going on. Uh. And then he has the. <laughs> <laughs> so cool, dude. All right. You can check out his album. There's going to be a link to that down in the description. I believe it's called Golden. I think it's out now. Comments, though. He gives us so many songs in such a short time, and they're all just perfect. You know, it, it really is kind of wild how quickly he was able to get so many high-quality songs together. It makes me wonder how long he has really been working on this album. You know, that's just me. For real, he is, in, in a lot of ways, sort of a musical genius. It's a little bit cringe to say that, but, you know, of course, also, he has such a great team behind him as well. But for most other people to produce this many hits in such a short amount of time is basically impossible. It does make me wonder a little bit how long has he been working on this album? You guys let me know in the comments down below because I'm genuinely curious. But anyway, hopefully you guys enjoyed this reaction. If you did, be sure you subscribe to the channel because I do my best to react to whatever Jungkook is up to as long as I'm allowed to do it without my video getting taken down. And there will be more like this on this channel as well. So be sure you subscribe for more. Check me out over on my Patreon. Obviously like the video because it helps me out. Anyway, till next time, Tristans. And Tristan. Peace.